So hi dear Sagittarius, a very very good afternoon to you guys. This is Anjali Tarot. This is a general love reading for all the Sagittarius Sun, Moon, Venus rising. Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you in the first place. The second thing, the roles can be reversed anytime. Third thing, this is a general love reading, general feelings, current feelings. So there's no time spent. So let's start. Sagittarius, your partner's current feelings for you right now are let's see what they feel for you. The star, the chariot and the temperance card. This person is feeling a soul connection with you. They feel like although you guys are moving on in different directions right now, they are still very hopeful and positive that in the future things are going to be very very good. These are three major arcana cards. So Sagittarius something very huge is happening. Something very life changing is happening in your life right now. Things are turning, you know, the events are turning in your favor but you are not able to see. You are like, what the fuck is happening with my life? Nothing is going right. But behind the scene, everything is going right. Everything is happening because of, because of a very, very huge reason. You are not going to understand it right now. You will in the future. So I do see that this person is very hopeful. This person feels like a soul connection, a soul tie with you. And this person feels like although this connection is moving forward, although both of you are moving, moving on might be from this situation, from this particular connection. But if you guys keep patience, if you guys will be you know uh, in this energy of balancing equations balancing the waters uh, balancing the emotion between you guys things are going to be fine in the future so this person is feeling like yes everything is going to be fine if they keep calm if they keep uh, their energy down right now if they keep their temper low right now if they just uh, try to meditate and heal the situation right so they are very hopeful and positive about the future Sagittarius Right now, both of you are moving on. I don't see both of you are on the same page right now. Even if you guys are together, I don't see you guys are, or are on the same page right now. And if you guys are not even together, I do see that one of you is hoping for a very good reconciliation and everything is going to be fine in the future. This is what you are hoping for. This is what your person is hoping for. So, uh, Aquarius energy, Cancer energy and Sagittarius energy that I'm getting here. Hopeful about the future, but right now moving on and keeping their hope alive, patient, very, very patient with you, very, very patient with this connection. Okay. Just let me pick the cards. Let's see. What you feel for them, Sajis? King of Wands, the Queen of Wands, and the Death in Reverse. Hmm. You feel like this person is your spiritual counterpart, partner in crime. You feel like this is a perfect match for you. You feel like this person is the one for you and you are not ready to accept this, that this is no longer the case. Sagittarius, you are living in some kind of illusion. You feel like this is the only person on earth who can match your frequency, who can match your vibration, who can match your energy and you don't want this person to let go of this connection. You don't want this person to move on from this connection, from this relationship. Okay, so I do see that, yeah, although you feel like this is your person, but there's separation going on, there is uh, healing going on, there is things going, there are things going on between you person, between you guys that, that are kind of invisible right now, you know, um, you know what is happening is energetically energetically both of you are healing both of you are moving on both of you are trying to you know make a room for yourself in in this world in this uh, universe but what is happening in the 3d is that in the 3d might be you guys are separated in the 3d you guys are not together even if you guys are together you guys are not on the same page and you are not able to release this person you are not able to let them go from your life you feel like if this person is not going to be with me no one is ever going to match my frequency match my energy and that is why i i, I will not release this person out of my energy out of my life because this is the only person for me this is not the truth sagittarius come on but yeah aries, aries leo sagittarius and scorpio energy you are not ready to accept that this is the end of this situation Sagittarius, this is what is happening on the other hand this person have accepted the truth they are moving on they are healing they are very ho hopeful and positive that in the future things things are going to be very good between you and them <coughs> even if it is just uh, 
like on a friendship level okay so let's see where is where the connection is he heading to right now what is the mutual energy of this connection two of swords cross roads nothing is clear everything is up in the air sagittarius right now nothing is clear between you and this person no one is understanding exact root cause of the problem no one is getting what is really happening in this connection so two of swords is like both of you are on the cross roads at least one of you is, uh, uh, one of you is on cross roads and i feel like this is you this is you sagittarius you are not able to release this person you are not able to uh, see your path clearly you are in illusion in some kind of illusion uh i so wish to clarify this but i don't want to do this because uh, i mean i cannot do this because this will be injustice to other signs right so i do see mutual energy of this connection going nowhere up in the air and uh, not having a clear picture not having a clear path of exactly what is happening okay so thank you so much for tuning in i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste